All right guys, we're in the shop and we are updating my Hummingbird Apex units. Um, this is something that uh, not enough people do. Green pumpkin brown with a little bit of red flake in there. That's key for down here. Big gap, big strong hook, point doesn't line up with It's very easy once you get the hang of it. You should be updating it as much as possible. The cool thing about Hummingbird and Minn Kota is they're constantly updating, upgrading, and advancing their units. So when you get into a Helix, a Solix, an Apex, um, you, it will continue to upgrade sort of like just like your iPhone, you're always putting that latest update in your iPhone. That's what you want to do with your electronics because they're always making them better, faster, clearer. Um, so when it comes to it, it's super simple. I'm going to run everything down right now and show you how I go about it. The very first thing I'm going to do is jump on the Hummingbird website. So um, just type in hummingbird.com. It's going to come up hummingbirdjohnsonoutdoors.com and you're going to go to support. So you're going to go to support here. When you hover over that, it's going to be right here. Software updates. I'm going to click on that. And now it's going to give you, you know, you can check out the current um, software versions right here. Um, but I'm going to go down, I'm going to choose over here on the left hand side, I'm going to choose what unit. So whether you've got Apex, Solix, Helix, I have Apex 13s. I'm going to hit that. And now I'm going to come down, hit the exact unit I've got. I've got the Mega SI chart plotters. And so now here, software update Apex series 4.190. So that's the first thing I want to know. And now I'm going to come over here to my actual hummingbirds. I'm going to hit home. I'm going to go to settings. There's a few ways you can do this. I'm going to go network and then network info. And right here, this unit model, and it's going to say software version 4.152. So it needs updating. And if you come over here to this one, I've already done it. So I'm going to hit home. I'm going to go settings network network info and software version 4.190 so this one's updated ready to go so now i have to do the, my last two so what i'm going to do is turn all of my units off if they especially if they're in a network in the ethernet box i'm going to keep just the one on that i want to update i'm going to get out of there and now i'm going to come back to my computer to get this update um, I've found a 32 gig is the best and so you can have a straight uh, a straight disc like this this is the best one from SanDisk I like to have you know the best sort of model you can have this standard size will fit in your Solix and but for the uh, Apex I need a, a micro so um, I have the 32 gig micro and I put it into uh, the normal size USB and that's going to be clear and empty and ready to go and i'm going to put it into my computer so that's in there and now i'm going to come down here and it's going to show all the latest versions for mega live they're constantly updating it making it better target lock ipilot link this is where you you need to make sure you have all of these versions so you can getting the best possible picture and quality out of your units and I, this is telling you all the fixes, like from that version to this one, there's a bunch. So it's going to be faster, cleaner, uh, all the things that you want to get out of your hummingbirds. I'm going to go all the way down. You can read through here. It'll give you all the instructions. But this is what I want here. Download Apex software 4.19. I'm going to hit that. And now it's going to start downloading over in this corner. And... I'm going to go down to downloads and I already have it downloaded so it's going to say all Apex files. I'm going to click on that and then you're going to see these files here and all I'm going to do is copy and paste. Come up in this corner or down here and I'm going to highlight it, double click, I'm going to copy it and I'm going to go over to here. This is my micro SD, you can see it's empty, double click paste 10 items 
Okay, so now those items are going to start to download and it usually doesn't take long at all. Um, you'll see them slowly working their way up and this is kind of what you want to see when, when it's downloading. You don't want to be too quick and you don't want it to be too slow. So less than a minute, those 10 items are all going and that's all the updates. That's Mega Live, all of them, Target Lock, my Raptors, because everything with Hummingbird is talking to each other. That's all talking and that's why you want everything on the same um, update in the same version and then they're all going to work perfectly. So five seconds to go. So that's downloaded. Okay, so yeah, on there, what, what you want to do is hit eject on this disc that, and it should turn off. Okay, so now I'm, I'm good to pull this the disc out from the side. The update is on that disc and now I'm going to come over to here you got your little uh, micro SD port here. I'm going to take the micro card out of that. This is just for the Apexes, for the Solix and Helixes. You can use the bigger one. I'm going to put this little card in. And if everything is done properly, it's going to automatically bring it up. A new software version is available. Would you like to install version 4.190? Install. I'm going to hit tick. And that's it. And now that is downloading. And uh, when it's downloading like that, um, it's going to take about 15 minutes. And, uh, and it's going to come up, tell you it's got the right version, go through and check it. I'm going to update the top one. And now my Mega Live, the 360, um, my new Ultrax Quest, Raptors, there's all the new best features and new features with the Quest, talking to my Apexes with battery monitoring. Um, running my Raptors off the button, off the Quest, uh, so many things. But the big key is Mega Live is constantly getting better. They are really working hard to get it to be the best out there possible, and it's so good right now. It is getting better every month. So always check Hummingbird, check your units, update everything, and that way all of your units will perform flawlessly for you, and you'll have the most updated version possible.